A very good evening to you from one of the great capitals in Europe. We are talking to you from the Portuguese capital, Lisbon. My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me, ready to provide all the analysis, is Stuart Robson. And with kickoff just moments away, we really should be in for a magnificent occasion. How do you see it panning out, Stuart? Thanks, Derek. Well, both managers will be reminding their players of starting the game quickly, pinning the opposition back, playing the ball forward, and regaining possession as quickly as possible. Hopefully, we get a really good game here. Here's the lineup for a Sporting. Well, they've got a good front three and a solid back five, but with only two in midfield, they could get overrun. It'll be interesting to see who comes in to support them, if anybody. Let's have a look at the initial 11 for the visitors. Well, it'll be interesting to see how the wingers play today. Will they stay high and wide? Will they come in field and support the centre forward? And how deep will they come out of possession? They're going to be key to this formation. And the game begins. Edwards. It's with Porro. And on to Edwards. And a chance to whip it in here. And unable to hit the target. Goal kick here. Yeah, but it's good defending. He knew he was going to be beaten in the air, but he did enough to stop him scoring. was difficult to predict in advance who might decide a game but you could make a strong case for this man I think Stuart what are you expecting to see from him I would describe him as majestic when he's playing at his best he glides past defenders he's got that ability to run with the ball into open space he can pick out a pass he can wriggle out of tight situations he's the most creative player on the field today Manuel Ugarte what can they do to stop him running at them? They could nudge in front. And still danger here. Disappointing pass. Magnificent defending. To being cow. And he did well to cut it out. Sorensen. And he takes it away. In with a chance. Oh, it was there for him, but unable to find the target. Well, he certainly went for power, but the accuracy just wasn't there. He should have scored that. Well, it was a foul, but good use of advantage by the referee. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Well, trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Really sitting deep now. That could be problematic. Sorry, Kaba. Oh, lovely incisive pass but ably intercepted when it looked as though they might be in. 
Paulinho. Anderson. Top class defending. He's got space. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it. And now they've been rewarded. Well, here's another look. And you can see what a good finish this is. He holds off the defender brilliantly and keeps his composure. That's a great goal. One nil then. Well, it stopped a promising attack in its tracks, and you wouldn't be surprised if there's a card coming out here. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Successfully cut out. Pedro Porro. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter attack. Well read to win possession back. Pedro Porro. Oh, fancy footwork. But no damage done, that's the main thing. Olsen. Sorry, Kaba. Sisto. Opportunity it is. And danger still. But wait a minute, that is offside. Well, half-time coming up shortly, and the home side on top. Stuart, interested to get your critique. Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going at half-time if it stays like this. Smuggled away. And it might be. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Can he deliver it with accuracy? Well, not the best clearance. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. And a corner for Sporting, playing well here. A really intense pressure applied. Straightforward piece of goalkeeping. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. It did look on for them, but not to be. This might be the perfect counter attacking opportunity. But timely defending when it mattered.
He's in with a chance. And a goalkeeper on top of his game. Well, it's great goalkeeping. What a big save that is. Can someone get on the end of this? And so it is, the first half story has been written. You certainly have got to give this man high marks for his work up to this point. So back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect. Gives it a go. And the flag does go up, must have been tight. And time for the change now. Nuno Santos. And the ball with Pedro Gonzalves. Can he make it count? And a goal to increase their advantage. It's a two-goal lead now. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Sisto, and there to intervene. And good pressure high up the pitch. Well, this would help them get back into the game. Well, it didn't really go according to the script, did it? Well, the less said about that, the better, because that's a really poor attempt in the end. Coates, Gonzalo Inacio, Pedro Gonzalves. Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. Can they convert? And that's the hat trick, tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle him. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Well, the action underway again. Sporting in control, and the route could very well be on here. Well, foul play, says the referee. So, a personnel change then. Well, there to intercept. On to Chanles. An incisive pass. 
Oh, and nearly on target. Not quite, though. Yeah, very nearly, but the goalkeeper had it covered. It wasn't really a great effort. Mateus Reis. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Coates. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. He's enjoying space. Rochinha. Sporting with acres of space out wide. It might be. Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Over it comes. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. Olsen. Anderson. Christopher Olsen. A bit of running room now on the wing. But the danger averted for now. 20 minutes to go in this one. Rochinha. Well read to win possession back. Marcus Edwards. Will it be? Well, flinging himself at it. Substitution time it is here. He's driven in the corner. Well, behind for another corner. Taken short. And crossing towards the far post. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on them. Let's take another look, because it's a well-worked short corner that just changes the angle of the cross, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Sviachenko. Sorry, Kaba. Christopher Olsen getting the better of his opponent. That's useful play. Still looking to get the shot off. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceedings? They haven't been at the best. Well, you have to ask, where's the defending? The keeper is completely exposed, but he still had to finish it, and he did it really well. It's a good goal. Goals in plentiful supply, 4-1 currently. Ten minutes to go then. Nuno Santos. Morita. Chances on. And brave goalkeeping to deal with the danger. Well, he had to get that right, didn't he? That's good goalkeeping.
Well, the seconds are ticking away and the home side in control. Stuart, what have you made of this? Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. Pedro Porro. And he has options available. An incisive pass. So now a corner. And played short. Well, not the pass he had in mind. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. This might be ideal for the counter. And let's give credit to the defending. Excellent ball over the top. Well, good defending. Clattered out of there. And the pass could do damage. Now, will they do it from here? That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is. He was so alert there. And now the delivery. And there it is, the final whistle. The home fans are going to be happy with this result. You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. but unable to find the target. Well, he certainly went for power, but the accuracy just wasn't there. He should have scored. And a goal! That will do it. They've been pushing for it, and now they've been rewarded. And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to stop it. And a corner for Sporting, playing well here. Well, this would help them get back into the game. Well, it didn't really go according to the script, did it? Well, the less said about that, the better, because that's a really poor... Well, they keep working away, looking for an opening. And that's the hat-trick! Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle it. On to Charles. Oh, and nearly on target. Not quite, though. Yeah, very nearly, but the goalkeeper had it covered. It wasn't really a great effort. Marcus Edwards. Well, flinging himself at it. Taken short. And crossing towards the far post. A goal! And I'll tell you what, on this sort of form, very few would lay a glove on. That's useful play. 
still looking to get the shot off. And there it is, a goal. But will it be purely a consolation at this stage of the proceeding? The pass could do damage. Now, will they do it from here? That's great goalkeeping. Well, what a save that is.